so today, this morning, ladies and gents, hi, how you doing? We're going to Asda. We're going to Asda to pick up our click and collect order. Obviously, we've got a bunch of meats already, so now we're picking up all the veg and all that kind of stuff. So, I knew that was going to happen. Right, I'll show you when we get it. Do you think Asda will mind? I'm uh, Asda with the same for his back. I still f***ing love you, babe. Ooh. This app, right, the Asda app, you tell them that you're here and they say that they'll bring your food. Oh, is this the, is this the woman? No. Is this her? She's just walking. What name is it? Hi, it's Liam. All right, okay, thank you. Do, any anything else? All right, ladies and gents. So here we have it. Here is the first grocery haul in the new flat. Absolutely buzzing to be doing this on my peninsula. So. All of the stuff that we have here is from uh, Asda and some of the stuff is going to last a long while and some of the stuff is going to last not very long. So there's no real kind of order to what I've done or how I've laid it out, but we're going to start from this side and walk our way over. Okay, so first off, a couple of treats. Myself and Charlotte enjoy an ice lolly uh, before bed if we're having something sweet, if we have a craving before bed and we're watching um, a TV show or a Netflix show or whatever, uh, we like to sit down with an ice lolly. So we pick low calorie options, i.e. fabs and fruit pastel lollies, 75 in a fab and just under 60 in a fruit pastel. Yeah, 58 calories in a fruit pastel. So if you can't fit them in, then you know, do some adjustment. Cauliflower, broccoli and carrot mix. We have some fresh ones as well, these are like steam bags, always like having these to kind of mix up. If we're going to have steak, I enjoy having a bit nicer veg, so slightly fresher or steamed veg or something like that. Uh, I also like asparagus, but asparagus is kind of expensive, so we've got curly fries because we fancied a change and we actually checked out the macros on these. Uh, and the Asda ones in particular, in comparison to the chips that we would normally get, French fries that we would normally get, uh, you can actually have the same amount as these. The macros were basically the same for the amount of like per 100 grams sort of thing. So we went for these and they were cheaper, which is always nice. Chopping boards, we've got three of these because at the minute we've just been using plates and stuff, uh, which is not good. We've been here about a month now and so that is just, that's just not good enough. These were four pounds for three and so bear that in mind that we have factored into the entire price of this order, which we'll get to in just a minute. Uh, four pound of it is gonna be for the chopping boards, which will last for a long, long time, you know? So, we've got some red onion, and we also got some avocado to go with the chicken meal that I'm gonna make. I'll show you that on the channel very, very soon. Some fruit, apples and banana, carb sauces, wholemeal bread, and some bagel thins. Next up, we've got some reduced fat cheese. This is the 50% less fat one. Uh, it's Asda's own brand, so it's not expensive. It's 73 cows per serving. One serving is 25 grams. I tend to put 15 to 20 on whatever I'm eating, so I tend to have less than one serving. Till now, we've been buying a block and grating it. Uh, but this time around on this order, this worked out cheaper per 100 grams, so we went for this. A dozen eggs, couple of low calorie crisp options as well. Pom bears, some of my favorite, 65 calories per packet, and squares, how many calories are in these? 97, so under 100 calories. You can still have these kinds of treats, guys. You don't have to completely cancel out whether you're bulking or whether you're cutting. You don't have to pick one, you don't have to have one or the other. You don't have to have neither, you don't have to have both. Just pick one, have one, and then be satisfied with that. But pick a low calorie option, like a fab, like a fruit pastel lolly, or like a pombe. You know, 65 calories in a packet of crisps. You can't go wrong with that. Here we have a couple of these. Uh, sometimes I like to make a roast, or if we have steak, and sometimes we fancy it with mash, we'll just have one of these. Half a packet of this is 200 calories. So whether you want 200 calories of rice, 200 calories of chips, 200 calories of mash, potatoes, chips, however you want to make them, Potato is potato. Obviously the amount that you can have may vary, so if you have 250 calories of these, it might be X amount of grams, right? But if you have 250 calories of this, it might be Y amount of grams, and one or the other, you might get more from one. So you just gotta pick. If you fancy mash and you have to have a little bit less, or fancy curly fries and you have to have a little bit less, so you don't go over your calories, then do that. But then you've had the curly fries, and so you get that satiation, you know? Packet ham, we've got some gravy, we've got some salsa. This is great to go on meals. Some light butter, some low-fat natural yogurt. This is great to go with granola or just in, in protein pancakes or something like that. A couple of cartons of orange juice, some semi-skimmed milk, and this is probably the key 
to life, ladies and gents. Not necessarily Asda's, but anyone any supermarket's own brand lemonade. It tastes the same as the expensive stuff, and this was about 17p. So we got four of them, I've actually still got a couple of them in the car. So we've got four of these, which will last us a while. Whenever we drink gin, whenever we make cocktails, a lot of it requires lemonade, you know? So we're not gonna go for the full fat stuff, we're gonna go for the diet lemonade, which is two calories per 250 mil, and this is a two liter thing, right? It's 20 odd pence. You know, you can't really beat it, you can't go wrong with it. So, I would highly, highly recommend that one, you pick up diet because it tastes the same. Don't tell me it doesn't, it tastes the same, especially when you're mixing it with gin. So you might as well go for the one that's gonna be dirt cheap and less calories. And then you can have the treat, you can have the gin, and you can have the cocktail, and it's not gonna be as many calories. You can add 100 calories to a drink easily if you have full fat lemonade. Don't, just get the diet one. It's cheaper, less calories, win, 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 win. Done now. So all of this that you guys see here was actually just over 40 quid and that is with the extra lemonade, that is with the chopping boards, that is with cheese that will last us ages, a bunch of crisps, lollies, these will last a couple of weeks, you know, a good amount of stuff, dead cheap. The first thing I'm going to do is tuck in to some orange juice. Yes, from the carton. Mum. Mm. Mm -hmm. This is my house now. What you got? What you got? Alexa, stop. Thank you. <laughs> Inside this box, ladies and gents, I have something which is going to take the media business or my capabilities, if you like, for the media business um, to the next level. Why, you ask? Well, at the minute, I've used one of these before, what is inside this box. But, what I have used has not been my own. I have not had my own to use. I have not been able to use it from the comfort of my own home. And inside this box, what is known in the biz as a Lazy Susan. Pretty much, it is a turntable spinning around thingamabob. Has a plug source there and it pretty much spins the subject on top of it, right? So I could put this candle in the middle, spin it around, get some perfect spinning shots. You know, like pretty much a lot of the content that you've seen on the media page uh, has been used, has been filmed, sorry, using one of these. Um, but this is a uh, very nice, very sturdy one that I have received in the mail today, and I'm buzzing to get using it because it means that companies can essentially send, as long as the machine isn't too big or the product isn't too big, people can then send their products uh, to me. I can film it all from the comfort of my own home. I can work from home. I can control the lighting in here. I can just shut the blinds and stick my lights on and stuff. Um, everything can be basically in my control and I can have a photo studio, essentially. So it'll be good for, for the media business. So I have been envisioning putting it here. Um, obviously right now it's pretty much used as a dumping ground. I'm just gonna stick it here for now. Um, but it's gonna go. Here, it fits perfectly. I can dangle the cord down, plug it in down there, pretty much set the camera up here and have my own little, little space. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. What's up guys? Number one, number two. We've got two things to open guys. Come on babe. Come on babe. Come on babe. Come on babe. Uh, we need a knife. Oh, it's nice looking. It was. Ooh. Oh man, My mother and father have bought us um, these things we are actually unboxing as a little kind of moving in gift type thing, like little novelty on display type things. So we've got some gold um, clippers for some for some fruit. We've got, what would you actually call these? Cocktail uh, sticks? Like yeah, cocktail picks for like martini glasses and stuff. So these dressing cocktails, you can... Uh-huh, uh-huh. And these, you go, babe. Stop in there. We'll, we'll go, it, right? Yeah. Check it, man. Oh, your porridge is ready. This, ladies and gents, is the best one. 
Oh my days, what the f <coughs> Look at it! Ladies and gentlemen, we have an ice bucket. This is our ice bucket for our things like this. Check it, man. Plus, it's just kind of like, you know, a nice ornament because we're probably not going to have stuff in it. A lot of the time, it just looks cool on the bar cart, right? Look at it! We may or may not move those. Tonight. We definitely need to move these. We should probably just drink these and get rid of them tonight. Cool, man. Check it out. Six hours later. Oh my god, it's a bit too frozen. Look. Should we put some ice cubes in it then? So earlier I also prepared a couple of cubes. As you guys know, if you follow me on um, Instagram, I actually made a Cosmo. One of the ingredients is cranberry juice, so we've got these little cocktail stick type things uh, which we're going to stick in the drinks a little bit later. One cube for each Cosmo and then these are just normal kind of ice cubes. A little something like that. See, never in doubt. Look at that. Oh, it, oh, it is a bit full. God. I tell you what, I'm getting better at that. Alrighty, Roo. Fancy. Way. Cheers, Mum. Cheers, Dad. So I want you guys to let me know in the comment section down below. Number one, where will you be heading to first? The barbers or the gym? Because apparently you can go to both on the same day. So let me know where you're gonna be first. I genuinely don't know because, I mean, look at me. It's just getting out of hand now. So um, I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. If you have, do me a massive favor. Drop it a like, drop it a comment down below, subscribe if you want to. Let me know what flavor porridge you think I just had in the comment section down below. Your four options are Stroop waffle, vanilla with toffee drops, salted caramel, and chocolate mint. They're the four options. I play this game on my Instagram and it's kind of fun. Let me know in the comment section down below. And one winner who guesses the correct answer will win one free giveaway entry for the MyProtein giveaway, which hopefully is actually arriving today. So I can film that and get it live tomorrow, I hope. That's if it's arriving. There's been a couple of delays, but. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, drop it a like, comment down below, subscribe if you are new. That was a grocery haul on a budget. We went to Asda and picked up a bunch of stuff for a bargain. Let me know what kind of food content, food challenges, anything that you want to see, let me know in the comment section down below. Thank you all so much for watching. Together we will grow, and I'll see you in the next one.